Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. And I'm just turning up the volume a little bit for my end. Uh, I did take a break. We're just on the say uh, now the load uh, screen actually. So let's just get right into the game. Let's get right back into it. Took a break. Uh, you know, I need to get part one up. So, of course, I couldn't do that. Ooh, chapter one. Welcome to the Kurumi Detective Agency. Perfect. Oh. Wow. Got the first trophy already. All right, that's it. LP's over. Thank you all so much. Thank Messy. Pretty generic for the, uh, for her. So... See, you got a good grasp on the situation. Too bad there isn't like an auto advance. Not that I'm really complaining, because then there's some time. That place in Shichuku, the one where you appeared when you logged out of, from cyberspace. It's the same, or very similar to the place you logged into, logged into Eden at, isn't it? Ah. Yeah. No. I logged in at home. Well, you're here talking to me now, but it seems there's another body out there for you as well. What does that mean? <laughs> there's another. Hey, can she please button up her shirt? She is showing off. Wait, she's showing up. Uh, over boob, under boob, and side boob. I did not think it was possible for any way to show off those three sides of the boobs. Like seriously. Maybe your metal da mental data was separated from your physical body and manifested in the real wor world independently? Or maybe your body was somehow moved to Shinjuku where it was corrupted into the form you have now. The whole situation is entirely too particular, yet here you are, standing before me, as much as that shouldn't make sense. At present, I can only form a simple hypothesis. We need to gather more information and quickly. Going by the book, you should check out where you logged into Eden, which was where. You know, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm feeling. I don't want to say regret because I love Terriermon, but I kind of wish I picked Palmon. Palmon would have been probably cool too. <laughs> Why are you helping me? Where are you now? You are at the Kurumi, Kurumi Detective Agency, which has solved a number of rather bizarre cases, including cyber crimes. Yay, cyber crimes! I can think of no way better suited to solve the mystery of what, hap of what happened to you than right here. And you're even sitting on the sofa for clients. Now, no need to worry about compensation. Your very existence is all the payment I need. Let's pretend you're board you board a luxury airliner say the Mary Celeste uh you lost me a bit there Kyoko anyway let's get back to track here where did you log in but first before we do anything else we must do something about your appearance yeah that'd be great can't even walk around outside like that and it looks pretty unstable as well huh <sighs> Did I lose my voice too? No, I shouldn't have, because I asked you a question. I have a good look, but... And you are truly a mass of data. A true digital body. Yet you hear my voice, sit in my sofa, and talk to me. Proof that you obey physical laws. Eh, it might be a bit of the stretch. With real world characteristics, let's call it a half cyborg body. Uh, Excuse me, what? I don't think so. Well, it's compressed of data, then it could be easily to do something about your appearance. Corporate Cabal Bebe. You should have the same basic structure as an avatar used within Eden. It would be excellent if there were avatar parts of the data found lying around in Colon. The only issue is whether or not you can log in in your current state. Yeah. Something happened with the television? Ah. 
Jump. Huh? Jump? Oh. Okay. Ooh, pretty. Urge on by the voice. I took a leap of faith. But what the heck happened? It looks like I can go forward after all. Oh, digital network. Okay. This is digital space where the information flow between visual due to the protagonist's cyber body. Choose your direction with the directional button of the left or the left stick. Battle may be initiated, so always be on guard when moving. <gasps> Terry Mons right behind me! Oh. I can't go back, I'll just have to continue. Uh, let's go this way. Oh, these are places to rest, okay. Ah, oh, screw it, let's see what's on the other side. Oh, battle, sweet. Alrighty. Ah, uh, let us use... Oh, that's changed. I thought that said charge for a bit. Let's use Terrier Tornado, because it hits both of them. Well, it killed, uh, the Boyomon. I think that was Boyomon. This is Bokomon. Bukamon. Bukamon? Mm. Yay. I'm having a blast with this game so far. I can't even complain about anything so far. I mean, to be fair, I am only like an hour in. Alright, that seemed to have not mattered. Oh. Hey! Why am I attacking four defenseless baby po- Di Oh my god. Bodamon and Punimon. Sweet. Why am I attacking poor defenseless baby Digimon? I feel so bad for this. Oh well. Momentine. Oh, I got a Botamon medal. Sweet. Still have no idea what those things do. Oh, let's go over here. Oh, I picked the... <laughs> Why do I always pick the one that doesn't show all the... Uh... I'm not show. Why do I always pick the one that do that doesn't have all three of them? Ocean wave. Yowzas. All right, since I can, since I have like two two other turns, and plus he's going to be dead with the, this attack. Might as well just heal. I am running low on SP though. And I just got a level up, so that was just completely pointless of me using it, but whatever. I also just noticed I'm getting yen for this, too. That's nice. Sure. The exit? It's, it's gone. Guess I can't go back the way I came. Is this Eden? This is Kyoko K Creamy. Can you hear me? I nearly lost you, but I managed to get a trace. What the heck happened? It looked like you were sucked into a terminal and just disappeared. Um, this is what happened. I see. I'm guessing you passed through the actual network lines themselves. The official terminal is connected to Eden's network. The office terminal, I think is what I said. No, whatever. You rode the flow within the wires as data and appeared in Eden. So then for you, the network appeared as an actual series of roads. Still, it's shocking to see you make such a direct transition from the real world to the digital one. You submerge in the digital world just by touching a terminal. A dive. No, a jump. Now, nope, the, the dive isn't in here. That's in Dream Drop Distance. Now I'm going to call the ability of yours a connection jump. What a happy little unexpected accident. 
Now you can go look around for avatar part data. Head to Col Colon. There's plenty of junk data lying around in Colon. It should be easy to find what you need. I'm so sorry if I'm butchering that word. I, I feel terrible when I'm butchering uh, Japanese words. Shocked girl. Oh. No, I'm not a hacker. I want to see what all these guys say. Yeah. Oh, is this a hacker lounge? All right. How'd I go? This way, come on. Huh? Guess I should go in the direction of that voice. Well, what? Okay, it's gonna just take me there. That's good. I was gonna say, well, where the fuck is the voice coming from? Oh. Hello. Ah, so you can hear my voice. Yeah, welcome to the Digilab. This place has a faint connection to the digital world, a paradise for Digimon. Oh, oh, the Digilab! I can all get more Digimon! I am Marie Mikagura. I open this paradise unto you. Huh? Digi Lab? The Digital Monster Laboratory. You could call it the DML for short, I suppose. I recommend calling it the Digi Lab, though. Digital? It's okay if you don't know about it, for now at least. When the time comes, I expect you will know what you need to know. Well, what do I need to know now? I called you. No, that's not quite it. It was you who called to me. You are beginning to develop a deep connection with Digimon. Our streams of fate intertwined and drew me in, and so I found you. In other words, it was you who called out to me. But that's enough of that for now. First off, what kind of place is this? Go and check it with your own eyes. Can I get... A... okay. In the Digilab, you can use a variety of facilities that will help you on your adventure. Digibank, organize your party, Digivolve, the Digivolve, and more. Raise your Digimon by training or feeding. Take a dun dig on dungeons you've already cleared. Oh, that's interesting. Purchase items for the Digifarm. Network battle. Recover Digimon. Oh, okay. Um, what does this do? No need to recover. Okay, that's the recovery one. Oh, this is the Digifarm. Digi I am not going to remember any of this. Island expansion. Two types of items are used to expand a farm island. Increase the number of islands, max 5. This will allow you to keep a great number of Digimon. Increase the rank of an island. This will increase the number of locations where you can place farm goods. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. I think they're that. I think they had something similar to this in Digimon Dusk and Dawn. Not one hundred percent sure. I think this is the connection. Welcome. Oh no, this is the buy. This is the shop. I have nothing. Oh, this is only for Digi Farm anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Alright, let's go to the Digibank. Okay. Digimon with a 100% scan rate or higher can be materialized and made it to allies. Alright. 
I thought I had something else that was 100%. Well, Poyo... Pabumon will give me a Tentamon at some point. Kodomon will give me an Agumon. Sure, let's get a Kodomon. Sweet. Oh, he's a he's an in training phase two. Okay. All right, let's do a Pabumon now too. Might as well get them both. There's nothing wrong with it. I kind of like it that you could just, as long as the Scanthine's at 100%, doesn't matter what they are. Type free, natural. Digivolve and D-Digivolve. Digivolve makes Digimon into even stronger versions of themselves. Digivolve returns to Digimon to level 1 but raises their max level and abilities. There is more than one dig Digivolution route and Digimon can Digivolve into various forms within the Digivolution guide depending on their the conditions met. There are also Digimon you can get by fusing two Digimon together through DNA Digivolution. Digimon can also undergo, undergo D-Digivolution. D will make them weaker but will increase their max level and abilities. Abilities affect not only the conditions for di digivolving but the maximum values of perimeters that you can enhance in digivolves. Okay. Okay, that's Gardramon. I have no idea what that is. That is Gadamon. I have no idea what that is. I definitely, I think I just want to get a Gardramon first. I, I don't care about the other ones for now. But, they probably won't be that bad of a thing. You have discovered, oh, so you just have to discover them before. Okay. I'm not going to de-digivolve. Pabumon, Pabu, Pabu, Pabu. That's Motemon, that is Yokomon, and I have no idea what that one is. Okay. Move Digimon. Yes. Yes. Now I should have those three. In yeah, I do. Sweet. Got more party members. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Mirror Dungeon. Okay. And Coliseum. Yes. Now what? Do I just do this? I guess. Do you understand the Digilab? Use it carefully the further your interaction with Digimon. Let me see if the if you're the person I thought you might be. Finally, one last thing. A small token of yours. Uh Oh, I got a hacking skill. Hacking skill shining connect combination with Digimon use, but are dangerous if used for unscrupulous hacking purposes. How you use your skills is up to you. Never forget that. You can deepen your special ties with the Digimon. Live with them, share their joys and sadness, and grow together. By de deepening your bond with the Digimon, they'll surely offer you their aid. It is a very important ability. It'll not even change your life. Sweet. Connection jump. That's what you call your curious skill. I know nothing of this power. It's like a hacking skill, but, well, different. But I'm certain it's a skill that will serve you in unique ways. I'll see you later. Take care. Cool. Hacking skill. When in the field, press the square button to open the hacking skill menu. Okay. Use the skill to... Oh!
Oh, whoa, hello. Communication devices that use the flow of the digital web. They are reference points for the digital network that connects to locations everywhere. The half cycle protagon half cyber protagonist can use connection jump to move from here to Eden in the digital lab. Real world can access can only okay, so the blue ones can only access the digi lab, okay. Data huh? Fusion call interx. Didn't I do that before? Okay. Oh, was this where we were? Was this the uh, where we fought? This is probably where we fought. The weird thing. Oh, hello. Oh, no, this is where we came from. Okay. Can eliminate security walls that block your way and continue your process. This skill has different levels depending on the resilience of the firewall, and you won't be able to take down the firewall if your wall crack skill isn't high enough. How do I use it? Oh. Probably help if I was... But I pre whatever. I press circle. Sweet. Can I go up the slide? No. Can I go on the swings? No. It's me. Ooh, I finally got through to you. I lost your trace info and had to search again. Where did you wander off to this time? Oh, you know. Digimon. So you're into Marie McArthur. Yeah, you could say we're acquainted. Regardless, for there to have been a natural progression where you would meet her, you seem to have the craziest luck. Let's assume you carried out your original objective. We'll start by. What? You've already broken through the firewall? Well done. You saved me some time. Hee <laughs> hee. Alright, on to our next move. I scanned the area around the entrance to Koala and marked my key junk data sites. Junk data will serve as your body parts. You need to go find and retrieve some. It's something of a stop gag measure, and it may not be a perfect solution, but I'm sure your skills are up to the task. This is a key step to return your body to normal, so buck up and get to work. Searching your for body parts isn't as hard as the Fiend 48 demons now, is it? Haha! <laughs> is that supposed to be a reference to something? Think of it as emergency measures. I look forward to meeting you in your normal body. Digiline, this is a tool to communicate with people who aren't in the same place. You will receive messages from your friends and Digimon in your Digifarms. If the notification appears at the bottom right of your screen, click touchpad button or click to or, or check your Okay. Hey, you oh, okay. I got three of them. Did I surprise you? But that's Oh. Did I surprise you? But that's what Digiline is all about, you know. The Digimon on farms will be excited if you respond to the Digilines. Got it. Cool. Okay. I am liking everything that's going on so far. This is, I'm having a blast. There's my digital line. Okay. I'm having a blast so far. This is fantastic. All right. Uh, let's see if we can get my body back first before we, oh, hey. Wait, did I enter the battle? This thing caused battle. Oh, the thing. Register to field guide. Scan data of new Digimon will be collected and the Digimon will be registered to the field guide of your Digivice. To DigiLive, you can digiconvert and browse data, detailed data by making friends with the Digimon through Digimon. Okay. Alright, Terrymon is up. Let's go. Uh, maybe I should have used the Terrier Tornado. Alright, what skill do you have? Bubbles! 
Nice attack, 30 water damage to one foe, 90% accuracy. Ooh, wow, my Cormon's strong. <gasps> no, Pabumon! Oh, I should've checked what Pabumon had. Way to go, Pabumon! Oh, wow. Obviously, the ex... Okay. Sweet. Obviously, the, um... Oh, I think that conversion theme was also a thing in Digimon Dawn, uh, Dusk and Dawn. Oh, man. Playing this makes me really want to actually play Digimon on my DS again. That's so fun. But I'm glad to play it on my console here. Ooh, Gatsumon and Biomon and Clamon? Digimon all have types and attributes, each with their own affinity. Digimon type is shown in the mark on the upper left part of stats and the attributes to play cut card. During target selection, good affinity is shown with a red target ring and bad affinity with a blue ring. Huh? Okay. There are four attributes. Or, yeah, virus, vaccine, data, and free. Obviously, free has no res uh, relation. Attacks from a type with a good affinity it flicks double damage. Well, attacks from a type with a bad affinity only flicks half damage. Okay, so vaccine. Or, oh well, yeah, obviously vaccine is very good against virus. Virus is good against data. Data is good against vaccine. Okay, uh, that kind of makes sense. Oh, here we are. Attacks with good skills inflict 1.5 times normal damage. Attacks using skills reflect the attribute of said skill. Obviously, water is better than fire, and fire is better than plant, plants better than water. Earth is better than electricity, electricity is better than wind, and wind is better than earth. Uh, again, no relations for that, and light and darkness balance out. Of course they do. Alright. So, wind's not going to do good against... Wind will do good against... Wind's going to do good against Gatsumon, at least. Oh, it was Clamon. I think that's Clamon. Oh, Sayakoamon. Way to go, Koromon. Uh, have you attacked Gatsumon? I actually, ooh, I actually like Gatsumon. Gatsumon's actually a pretty cool Digimon, in my opinion. So I probably will get a Gatsumon on my team. Ooh, Terramon, oh right, because he was a data. I need to pay more attention. Kromon leveled up. Pabumon leveled up. Right. I'm gonna have to keep referring to that, or I'll just have to write it down at some point. I didn't really want to write it down right now, obviously, just because it'd probably be annoying. That, uh, yeah. Uh. Hey, we can see what's over here now. I should, I should have gone check this out first before I did the, um. Well, I thought, th I thought this was progression. Hey, Sudamon. Back attack. How dare you? Well, you're done anyway. Attack boost. Oh. What'd I get? Oh. Such a quick reply. I'm impressed. Guess you get to reply to a reply sometimes. Okay, uh, I want to see that item. Items, 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 items. Uh, there we are. Oh, only battle wise. Okay. Okay, I got Pokemon Metal. Okay, is there. I hope I can. I could probably increase my part memory soon. 
Um... This is cool. Shukaman, shukaman, shuka, shuka, shukaman. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay. That's not what I wanted. There's, uh... Oh, I thought this could let me do my Digimon skills, too. Hi. You aren't worthy of getting further access. Once you've proven your strength and pride as a hacker, the path will open on its own. But I... Okay. Well, I guess I don't feel so bad now. He probably would have said the same exact same thing to me. If I, uh, tried to do it earlier. No, let's suit him on. And another dead suit him on. Alright, Koromon and Pabumon got another level up. But no skill has been learned. Alright. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Oh, oh, oh. I wish that kind of showed up on the map. Hey, it's a Pabumon. Venom Trap. Oh. Oh, of course, they need to teach me this. Allies and enemies can suffer from abnormal statuses and battles. Abnormal statuses have unique effects such as draining HP every turn or altering stats. All abnormal stats are undone by the end of the battle. End with turn. Confusion. Paralyzed. Sleep. Stun. No self-healing. Poison. Dot. Bug. Okay, and there. Yep. Alright. Just get rid of it in one hit. Terrymon, thank you. Alright. Let's get my next part. Unless that was all. Nope. Still more to get. Hey, it's a Pokemon. Ah. Uh, Terra Tornado should take care of them both. Oh no, the Pablumon's still alive. Alright, Kodamon, take care of it. Yay. Now I got Pablumon medal. What are these medals for anyway, I wonder? Are they anything special? Or are they just something I can sell? Sudamon! 100%! So I can get a Sudamon now. I think I'll hold off for a while before I get any more Digimon. I wonder what. I because it says something about like 200% was the highest I believe it could go. I wonder what would happen if I do that with a 200% thing. Yay, a new room. SP Capsule C. An export? What does that do? Ah. Pseudomon, you made me not. Alright, look at Let's see what an export does. Oh, that's obviously not something I can use here. I wonder what happens when that combo thing fills up too. Obviously, I probably won't find out until I face like boss Digimon or stuff like that. Export. Initially, it returns party to the dungeon entrance. Oh, okay. That's cool. All right. Cross combos and cam. A cross combo can occur when two or more allies are lined up on the timeline. Cross combos powered up attacks and skills effects with the help of allied Digimon. Cross combo effects are split into the following types. Chain attacks, increase the number of hits. Uh, damage up, increase damage. Heal up, increase the amount recovered. Skill up, stat changing skill, increase the amount of change. Cross combos. A current rates are displayed on the timeline. The bigger the gauge, 
number, the higher the rate. A little high. Okay, the gauge fills as you attack, and Digimon with higher camaraderie will. Okay. I don't 100% understand that. But let's just see what happens. Okay. Well, I guess that answered the question of what, it'll ha what the whole combo th meter thing is. Boyomon. Boyo, boyo, boyomon. Boyomon. Boyo, boyo, boyomon. Alright. Am I. Yay, I'm in my body again! Hmm. You at least look normal again. It's not a perfect solution, but it's a big step. The object has been met. Come back to the agency. What's that? You don't know how to get back? Hmm, try logging out like you always do. Since you went in through the, an agency terminal, my guess is that you should come out through one. But to be honest, in your case, I don't know what will happen until we try. In the worst case, if your dad gets added through the network, I'll salvage as much as I can. I'm joking, sort of. You're so reassuring. Super reassuring. But anyway, that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Digimon uh, Cyber Story. In the next part, we'll go return and talk to Miss Kyoko and see what she has to say. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next part.